<laughs> oh yes. I think you can say that today is officially the start of Rivals 3 as we know it. <laughs> like we have shot a couple of things, but we're gonna reshoot that. But today is gonna be a very fun day uh, because we're meeting up with some old characters that are gonna join us. <laughs> Um, together with a good old friend that has been in one of the first B-rolls actually that we shot with A7S3. Mr. Dorian. Hello, hello. hello. It's gonna be fun, right? We're gonna have a blast. As our main light, we're having the uh, Nanlite Forza 500 watts so that we can increase it and make it extremely bright if we need that. But we can also keep it very low so that we can have this nice moody lighting. And uh, to it, we have a softbox that is 120 centimeters. I think that this is a perfect kind of softbox when you're on location. I would probably say that 120 or 150 is the way to go. If you were to go a little bit lower, like a 90 centimeter softbox, then you don't get this like environmental feeling when you're lighting the scene. But we also have here in the back of the bar, Nanolite Pava Tubes as well. These are the actual poker markers from the poker b-roll and they're super cheap. I know that they look cheap, but I don't want to spend too much on the props as long as they look good in the video. And this is the actual mat that we used in uh, the poker b-roll as well. The only thing that we did was that we flipped it over so that we didn't have all these ugly markers and just had a nice green color on it. I think that this, this is the one that he uh, put down <laughs> into the glass. The famous one. <laughs> the famous one. And, oh, this is gonna be exciting. Oh, yeah. This is the vest that he wore, Oscar. It's gonna be good to see if he can still get into it or if it's gonna. <laughs> <laughs> are thick, like really thick. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Peter is actually I can still see one of the first blind super YouTubers in the world. <laughs> 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 Thanks to the tour of this villa bilen bilen bro. Du det är mycket pengar som står på spel här. Du blåser ut och back. Du kastar korten och sen blåser du ut. 3, 2, 1, nu. Det känns bra. Nice. När, när du ser att han slänger sig, då ska du ta upp den snabbt som fan bara hiva i. Ja. Så du är liksom så här stressat tar du upp den och så bara gör du ner ja. på hans pokemarker, kort och allting. Ja. Men när du börjar roffa åt dig då så kan jag börja... Så går jag. Ja. As you probably have seen, this is my friend Jonas and this is my friend Oscar. Oscar from the poker b-roll, Jonas from the office b-roll. We're gonna tie this whole thing into Rivals 3 and the one that Oscar is playing against is in fact Jonas and the reason that he folds like one card flips over is because he's playing against the Royal Street Flush. So I'm playing the, the office guy in this uh, scene. I do photography and uh, a bit of the product and portrait photography. I publish my behind the scenes on Instagram. It's really good, extremely, extremely detailed behind the scenes stuff that you're gonna learn a whole lot from. And uh, Oscar has been in my videos for ever since we started YouTube. I think like the first popular video was the one where we were working out yeah. <laughs> in the outdoors gym. Yeah. I'd recommend you go and show him some support as well over on his Instagram. Both amazing dudes and you're gonna have a lot of fun following them.
Cheers. You don't like it? No. No. Oh. I'm trying. I'm trying. Oh my god. Morning. It was a good night's sleep. And uh, I sound worse than I feel. And uh, I'm not, I, I'm feeling good because I didn't bring too much whiskey yesterday. So I'm not hungover, which is, hey. It looks way warmer than it is. <laughs> it is so incredibly cold. <laughs> Four eggs, some basil, some uh, sausages, sandwich, cheese, ham, butter. We are currently in a place that is called Lanskrona, and uh, me and Oscar was actually here almost exactly one year ago and shot the short film Aftermath. And uh, we're actually gonna shoot at the same location and start shooting Rivals 3 and tr trying to piece everything together and see if we can make some sort of story from Aftermath and include that into Rivals 3. And this is gonna be a fun day. This is a, such an insane location to record a movie in, but it's also probably one of the best locations that I've ever been in. It's like 25,000 square meters of space that's totally unused. You guys feeling ready? Yeah. <laughs> Anton? Yeah, super pumped. Super pumped. Anton is uh, going to be the behind the scenes filmer for this entire thing, since me, and Edwin is going to be behind and in front of the camera. Anton is to the rescue! Yeah. Go show him some love on his Instagram. Oscar, how do you feel? Revisiting an old character? I'm still getting into the right mood here. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Looks good though. I'm also gonna change into the rival's gear. I actually fixed my head yesterday and it still feels weird seeing my, uh, my bald yes, uh, as we say in Swedish, but uh, Starting to get more and more used to it. I look way more badass without the glasses though, because you know, I look like, oh, can not look like Walter White with glasses. Who are you talking to right now? <laughs> Who is it you think you see? We are uh, having a Nanlite Force 300 bag as our prop bag, where we have all the things that we're gonna use for the shoot. Smoke machine and all that stuff that might come in handy when shooting these things. And as for our main lighting, we are going to have the mix panel together with Nanlite Pavo Tubes 30C, four of them. Your main gimbal is gonna be the DJI RS2. And I gotta say, I'm pretty much excited for how this thing is going to turn out because this has been in the works for, I think it was like five, six months. So it's gonna be fun. <laughs> You always feel so badass when you get this on. Good job, eh? I don't know if you remember this, but it's the place where we shot Aftermath and the money shot of Oscar walking in the dust exactly one year ago. And uh, we got some friends here as well. Pigeons. All of this is pigeon poop. Look at that. Slip and slide. I don't want to go in that. Voila! How did you get into this on the night? Did you not win? I don't want to see the wetter. Ooh! Oh, snow cam. This is gonna look so good. Edwin, dust the location, get approval. First, uh, first intro scene done, and it felt felt really good. Hey, mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna move, uh -huh. move, move.
move around the lights. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, last time that I was in this very spot, I ran behind Oscar with a gimbal. I'm gonna show you a clip right now. I think it was after that clip that we decided that no, we're not gonna be able to shoot the behind the scenes for this. Lighting mode. And then we can go into, let's see, something that is called the boost mode. Now we are at 150 watts exactly, and we can run this for three hours of this. So we're gonna have a lot of time. Nice. So, avstamp hårt med vänster fot, liksom. Se om du kan vinkla. Ja, det är mycket på en gång, men svärdet så att det inte. Precis, så att du har det liksom bara helt rakt ut. Typ. This entire fight scene is Edwin's baby, and he is the one shooting it since me and Oscar is uh, doing all the acting, so Highly recommend you to go in, check his Instagram, support him for making such an epic fight scene possible. I think that when he hops on, you prepare the pistols. This shot will be just a part of it. Yeah, so yeah. What we can do is that we go there from, so that we have to go and so on. Nice. Officially done shooting day one, and I think that everyone is extremely tired. We got some incredibly cool shots, and looking so good. So uh, very productive day one, and uh, let's take a change out of these clothes because oh, there's so much sweat and pigeon poop and everything else. <laughs>